Hi Pratmesh. Firstly, congratulations for your placement. Can you tell us a bit more about the company that you've joined and the role that you've taken up? I got the opportunity in Tata Alexi. So Tata Alexi is the like they are providing service company. So they are providing a uh, uh, many softwares in automotive industry. So I selected for automotive, and now I got the department as a transport department. So in that we uh, we are going to build some models in Simulink and um, MATLAB. So for the customers like automotive uh, tire customers, so we are providing them uh, models so they can run their softwares and complete their project. Okay, that's nice. And uh, can you uh, tell us a bit more about your undergraduation also and what is, what is it that you studied there and how was it different from the skilling course that you did? Firstly, I complete my diploma from the uh, Maharashtra State Government. Then I uh, joined to the uh, Mumbai University. So in the Mumbai University, as an electrical engineer, I completed in 2019. So my last year project also electric vehicle. So from there, I want to take an interest to uh, an enthusiasm about the electric vehicle. So I want to join uh, this kind of courses. So I uh, start searching in on the internet. So I got the, about the skill link. Before that, I joined to the uh, Thermax company as a just to survive the life. So I just joined with uh, uh, Thermax company. After one year, I got that the skilling is such kind of course. So uh, there, I can express myself and get some skills, uh, learn about more about the electric vehicle. So I immediately joined the skilling and quit the Thermax company job as a maintenance engineer. So uh, as a comparing uh, skilling and my uh, degree, in the degree just theory part is uh, they are taught us, and in the skilling we get the uh, industry level uh, the skill sets we need in industry that is given by skilling so in the skilling i got that uh, confidence also so and one more thing like after the graduation just completed that time my confidence is very low so and now after the skilling uh, you can just see my confidence also so it's boosted by skilling i think yeah that's nice pratmesh thank you so much and let's talk about the projects that you did how relevant do you think that the projects that you did here at Skilling was to the job that you've got? Uh, the pattern of project is very nice in Skilling. So first, when I joined the Skilling, I was a little bit scared or nervous that time. So I thought uh, I will uh, capable to do that or not. I will uh, sustain for a whole period or not. So I, that time I nervous. But whenever I uh, joined the Skilling in Bangalore Center, uh, all the support engineers are very good means the course contents like from the basic part to total uh, industry level projects they teach us like that so first they uh, complete all the introduction basic part then they give the uh, introduction about the skills and the softwares after the software they give some projects like actual electric vehicle so as a rickshaw model then battery management system model which are uh, very relevant to the, our industry le- relevant projects uh, because I, I just uh, saw in Tata Alexi there are also some projects like a battery management system so I am allocated for the battery management system and these projects are already done in skilling so I li- little bit know about the battery management system so I can grasp fairly fastly in the Tata Alexi project so I can complete quickly these projects so these are some uh, kinds of skill set in the uh, skilling and after the uh, battery management system, ADAS course is very nice. I like a converter course, like converter design course is very nice. So because of that converter course, in the Tata Alexi interviews, some questions from converter course. So with that help of this converter course, uh, I can use that answer in the uh, interviews also. Can you tell us a bit more about how your understanding of the domain has changed after the skilling course? Yes, sir. Uh, I already uh, told you, sir, that uh, I completed the regenerative bike in uh, my last year engineering. So I'm very interested about that, uh, how it exactly works, the converter parts or the pulse width modulation parts. I just know about the motor. This is the motor. This is the hardware part of motor. This is the part of uh, controller. So uh, when we use the throttle, the controller will control the pulse width modulation and use to the motor. So that time I was uh, known about that switch. So after the skill leak, I know about the, how the controllers control the current, control the voltage and use the uh, pulse width modulation to the motor, how will the voltage be given to the motor, 
what is the duty cycle what is the protection systems we are given to the uh, motor what are the thermal protection we have to given to the motors or battery management system just in my project we taken the lead acid batteries but now i can know about the lead acid uh, lithium ion batteries so how can we build the lithium ion batteries battery pack so about the safety product about the thermal uh, safety uh, in the batteries uh, these are the core domain knowledge i get from the skilling so i am much more confident than in graduation and now okay. that's nice so earlier you knew everything is individual parts individual components at skilling you understood how it all comes together i know about that yeah motor is running uh, in clockwise anti clockwise but i don't know why it is running in clockwise and why it is running in anti clockwise why it is gets stopped because of the uh, yoke is converted uh, because of this converter so that's all the concept get cleared by the skill so that's very nice thank you so much for that approach now can you also tell us a bit more about the interview process itself Obviously, at Tata Electric, you would have gone through multiple rounds of interviews. You would have, you know, uh, taken uh, multiple tool tests. Yeah. How easy or difficult was it to handle that after going through the entire mock interviews and mock tests over here at Skilling? In the Tata Electric, they first do the one tool test. So uh, I will first explain about the tool test, then go to the uh, interview process. So because of our course completed in Ardas. atosar then converters due to that in the ardas course i complete that project because of that experience of that project the tool test very easy to me because they give the two questions so first question is from we have to build the props from the scratch to total project and the second question is like that they gives one model so from that model we have to recognize what it is the fault and fix it and then we have to run that project so that both two tool test questions and easily get understand and build that first question model and the second i easily resolve that problem and solve that model so normal people will take the around 4 to 5 hours but because of the, this experience in skilling so i uh, just in one and half hours i get complete that two questions and after that i uh, made the report on that and sent to the tata alexi this is about the tool test they given after the tool test i selected for the interview so from the skilling consultants company they they told us you selected for the tata lexi for next round so in the skilling they take a mock interview like shilpa ma'am whatsal sir that take the interview so after the interviews they gives a set of question how to answer that question and the what type of question they will ask in tata lexi so this kind of Uh, material they given by Tata Alexi, so this is very easy to answer in real interview. So after that mock interview, again there is one aptitude test. So we know about the uh, uh, we given some aptitude test in skilling also. So because of that experience and because of that knowledge, we easily crack that uh, aptitude test also. So after the aptitude test, the interview is going. So like two technical person take the interview. So. from the mbd domain one interviewer is there and from the electric domain one interviewer is there also so around 45 minute takes to complete one interview in the interview like they ask the about electric vehicle basic questions first then goes to the some advanced level questions and about the mbd also so uh, how what kinds of blocks they are used and from that blocks how you can build your project so this kind of question they ask in the tata alexi so i know about the questions and how to answer that so i easily crack the interview sir. and so because of that i got this opportunity excellent and uh, also obviously you must be very elated for this so would you take this opportunity to recommend skilling to other students as well yeah sir actually i referred two students today itself so like uh, I, i i don't remember the name they uh, after i post on the linkedin uh, they saw my linkedin post and they asked us some question like how you got the opportunity in tata alexi because tata alexi has very much competition so i suggest them to if you are fresher or if you are want to join tata alexi like ev domain companies or you are very enthusiastic about the electric vehicle or automotive industry so you join the tata alexi i will refer you and i explain about uh, every process in the skill link so they will build your resume also they will build your uh, linkedin process then you, they will build your 
confidence then they will prepare for your interview and then you will get placed to the company interview so you can crack easily interview so you will you will get the job like me so uh, i referred to or three people thank you so much for that pratnesh thank you for taking the time off to talk to us we hope uh, you great success in your career and we also hope you come back to us to grow further in your uh, career thank you so much thank you so much